How you doing guys? Welcome to the Masking Alpha Club. We'll try to build men to be the most masculine alpha for yourself. Men, welcome. If you feel more also watching this, welcome. Today I want to talk about you will always have this burden. You will have the burden to perform. As a man, you 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 have to create your value. I look at myself when I was in high school, and I compare myself now. I'm a way more developed individual. I have my baby coming in. I'm very mature. I've learned a lot of things. And I realized as a man, you, you as you get older, things get better. You have the burden to perform. You have the burden of performance to create your value. I mean, the, being a man is not easy. You know, being, a man is, being a man is not easy. But if you're willing to put in the work, which I always say is a burden of performance, making six figures is not no like, oh, wishy-washy feet. I'll tell you that. I'll tell you that much. I'll tell you that much. Making over only 10% of the populace is making over six figures. Only 10% of the populace is making over six figures. So for you to reach that threshold is not easy, but you have a burden of performance to hit that magical intrinsic number. <laughs> you have that burden of performance. You have that burden of performance to stay in shape. <laughs> you have that burden of performance. You have that burden of performance to protect and to provide, you have that burden of performance. And I always say this, I'm like, a lot of times we've been deluded, we've been lied to, we've been fed, oh yeah, you could be average, and which you can, if you choose to be, you can. But if you want to live, you're gonna live an average life, you're gonna have a below average um, female in your life. And this, that's just, that, that's, that's just the reality. And when I say average, it's not only financially. Cause I, I made a video about this. There are four aspects, Four main aspects, and this is tangible aspects. This is tangible aspects. Physical, financial, emotional, and mental. P me, I add spiritual on it, but these four things are the critical ones. <laughs> these four things are the critical ones. My mentor told me this. I had I, was, I always do spiritual in there, but he's like, listen, spiritual is something that you cannot really, um, it's something that you cannot really it's not something that's really tangible. If I tell you, oh, okay, spiritually, X, Y, and Z, it's something that you can't really say, okay, now here. Some people could do the work. I'm not saying it's not possible. I'm just saying for the majority of people, that's not really something that they can conceptualize. So mental, you could say, okay, having a strong mentality, having a mentality, I'm going to do this, having grit. Have a grit. Like, I'm going to keep going on until I get it. I'm going to go on. I'm going to keep going. If I feel in this, I'm going to try this. I'm going to do this. That grit the mentality. I'm going to tell you I could do it. That's something that you could see. That's something that's tangible. Like, do action. You can see that. Emotional sturdiness. A man who's emotionally sturdy, a man who's not crying, like, oh my God, it's stressful. A strong man like that. Financially, a man, but now, man making all six figures. Financially strong. And physically, just having a nice, just working out, just 10K by being a strong man. You you can't, you could be average in probably one area. Let's say you're average in finances. You better not be average in your emotional, mental, and physical. If you're going to be average in two, you, may, you have to excel in, in, in other two. And I said, if five, you, if, if you're spiritual, excel in at least three out of the five. Minimum two out of five, you should excel. If you want to have average income, best believe you have to be above. And I said, it's the burden of performance. It's not easy. For me, it's not easy to, I got, I got to work out tomorrow. It's not easy to wake up, lift heavy weight, go to work. Lift and w walk over two miles at work because I have a physical demanding job. Sleep. Do that again. Make YouTube videos. Work on my product. It's not easy. But I realize as a man, I have the burden of performance. I can't sit down and act I can't sit down and act last days ago because the lifestyle I want, the lifestyle I want for my future, fa for my family right now and my future family, it requires me to put in a, a lot of work into my soul, into my craft, into my future. And I want you gentlemen to know this because this is something that I'm really pushing forward. Be above average. Be above, because you have a burner of performance and average is not really performing. And females, you too have a burner of performance. By preserving your value, by taking care of your value, by taking care of your value, by building virtue, by be, try, by working to be a virtuous woman, 
but working on your femininity, but working on your nurturing side, but working on your physicality, by working out, by looking fit. I would say this, you had to, the, the man, if a man's working hard, he's coming home, he's coming to see Lizzo laying down with some tea, so he wants some tea. That's not very, mo that's not very motivating for a man. A man ain't gonna wanna work. A man ain't gonna what is this? I don't wanna work. Cause it's not very good motivator to work. I tell men you still have to get out the mud out of the way. But you had to work on that as late ladies. It is not easy. I, as, a, as a female, it's not easy. I understand that. If you have kids, you have so many things going on, but you have to prioritize that. That has to be on your top list. Nurturing yourself, taking care of yourself. Go to spas. Go get your nails and feet done. Take care of yourself. I said it's not easy. It's going to cost a pay. But you do that, you're going to re receive dividends at the end. You're going to receive dividends at the end. And men, you have a better performance too. Work on your mental. Work on your emotional. Because you can look like a man, but then you're just emotional out of whack. You're just over here crying, complaining all the time. There's nothing I ever complain about that I did not change. So as a man, you had to know, oh, then I have a burden performance. I had to go out there. Even if I'm making average income, I need to go and see how I could flip this income. I need to see how I could save and invest it. I need to see how what business I could do to supplement this income. I'm an average man. I need to work on my mental. I need to work on my emotional. And it's not going to be easy. As a man, go out there and get me. Go out there and put them long hours. It's not easy. I'm doing 12 hours every day. It's not easy. But it comes with the territory. As I said, it's a burden of performance on both parties. You have the burden of performance as a man. You also have the burden of performance as a female. But I'm not going to lie. As a female, you could, you could get away with a lot less. You could get a little way and the guy will still be there. You could, you could get away. But as a man, let your money suffer. We'll see how long she's gonna be there for. I don't care what you guys say. I don't care how much. Oh, X, Y, Z. In this day and age, we see how long she'll be there. And I put money on that. We we'll see how long she'll be there for. And if she stays there, it's gonna be one miserable relationship. Even crackheads have wives and girlfriends. And look at their relationships. The girlfriend kicking them, spitting on them. So, especially as a man, I always say you have a burner performance. Because you cannot lax out. You cannot. A female could lax out and still, man, could be there. Just out of honor and duties, like I'm be here. But for a man, for a female, for a man, I'm sorry, for a man, you don't have that luxury. It's a quote from the Godfather that I really love, but I'm ending with this. And I always say this. He said, women and children could be careless, but not men. And that really struck some chords in my heart, because I'm like, dang, these basic the, the burn of performance. We cannot. We cannot afford these things, as government systems, these things that will support a female and a, and a child. But there's nothing really for men to support you. So as a man, you have to go out there and get it. But once you get it, guess who's the prize? Once you get it, guess who's coming after you? Everybody. Once you get it, guess who gains the respect of their peers? And who the respect of the people around them? You do. Because you're putting that work into yourself. The, the long nights. The, the times where people looked at you and did not give you the respect you deserved. Or you thought you deserved. The times people didn't think you were going to make it. The times where people looked at you and said you were crazy. The times where people didn't believe in your dreams. People didn't believe in your aspirations. People didn't believe in your ambition. Now you're coming back. You're coming back for murder. And as you should. And the world will be your oyster. The world will be your oyster. I would say if you're a female and you work on your uh, physique, you work on your mind, you work on your um, uh, feminine side, you work on your um, nurturing side, and you mix that in with wisdom and virtuous, and a woman who looks who who looks up to God. Now you could you you are in position for that type of man, because once you start dealing, once you start going to that level. A man will respect you and start treating you how you should be treated. And since you have wisdom, you're not choosing any type of guy. 
But these are attributes that are hard to work on. These are things that are hard to work on. And the earlier you work on, that's one thing I that's why I try my best. I still mess up in the game, guys. I'm not acting like, oh, I'm free. I'm doing good. I'm just this beautiful, wonderful guy on YouTube. I'm not going to say that. I have a whole playlist of, well, I was lying to myself as a high value guy, but I wasn't. So I'm here to be real with you. I'm not here to lie to you. I'm here to be real with you, show you my mistakes, show you where I failed at, show you my journey on becoming a high value individual. So I want you guys to be on that journey too. If you're a female, be on that journey, work on yourself. You want a high value male, but you're looking like a low value female. A man wants to be inspired. He don't want to go home and look at a Lizzo talking about I made tea for you. And I understand it's hard and you, a guy will still be there, but at a certain point, a guy not a guy's going to leave or a guy's just going to be like, there's no point in me even doing this no more. Because you're not holding your weight. But as a man, I always tell you as a man, females could catch some slack. But as a man, there's no slack, cutting. Once you lose that job, we see how long the relationship is. And if it's going to last, it's not going to be at a point of respect and honor for you. It's going to be a sport of of um what's the word it's something cringeworthy she's not gonna look at her look at you with high esteem people not gonna look with you with high esteem look how they treat bums look how they treat men who don't got nothing people don't respect that no nope. men don't respect that kids don't respect that children don't respect that cats don't respect that dogs don't respect that the parents don't respect that nobody will respect that and you just gotta really just accept that and a lot i see that and a lot of men don't want to accept that i see that a lot a lot of men don't want to accept that I have a duty of performance. And it's going to be hard. Just go out there and keep getting it, guys. Go out there and keep grinding. I'm going to go out there and I'm going to, I'm going to make another video about my goals. One of my subscribers asked me, Dana, what's your goals? Big and small. I'm going to go make another video about that, of my goals. That video is coming up soon. Actually, I'm probably going to make that video. That video probably already came out. But check that. I'm going to have that video out of my goals and my ambitions and my um, journey of becoming a high value individual. I have Alpha Strong ebook, 50% off. Checking the link down below. It's for my YouTube viewers only. It's a great ebook that teaches you why you need to be strong as a man, why you need to keep going as a man, and why weak men are despised by everybody in the community. Comment, like, and subscribe. Hit that like button. Comment down below. I'm trying to build my channel to 400 subs. 400 subscribers coming next. We're going to hit that thousand by the end of this year. Watch. Watch. We're going to hit that thousand by the end of this year. We're getting better every day, guys. Let's go.